everybody. The reason why I started taking care of the cemetery was because of the condition it was in. So I came like a caretaker for the cemetery. And I love taking care of the cemetery. I was not looking for praises or to be a volunteer for the cemetery. I did it out of the kindness of my heart because I have great grandparents in here and my love. Hello to my YouTube channel. If you want to hit subscribe, hit subscribe. If you like my videos, hit likes. If you do not like my video, you can hit thumbs down and you can leave me a comment. I will be having an updated video in April of two years of taking care of the Riverside Cemetery where my great grandparents are in and Isaac Laconi is one of them and his first wife passed away from childbirth and he got re- I'm gonna give you a small tour on the cemetery so I'm gonna take the camera and this is gonna be like an induction video so I can make the big video for you guys. But this is my great grandfather Isaac Lacody. And I'm gonna take you on a tour of the cemetery and show you guys what it looks like. We'll start over here. So I can give you guys the history and how I got started. That's gonna be in another video. There are veterans in here that fought in the Civil War. There's World War II veterans and in here as well. I think we're doing the cleanup today. So far it's just me and William, my boyfriend. We're gonna start in this section. Over here, this is what it looks like right now. We don't know how much we're going to get done, but we're going to work our hardest and do our best. So we're going to trim down some of these yuccas over here. So here are smiling down upon us. It's a nice sunny day, a cool day, so I can feel everybody's presence in here. I know they're watching over us and then this. This is the progress we got done. You ready? These are the branches we cut down. All right here. Out of the cemetery. I hope you guys can see me. All these branches. Yes, there's cars going by. More branches. Branches there, branches there, and the yuccas that we cut. That's the progress that is out here. There goes a bus. New Jersey trains at bus. All right, let's show you the progress we have made in the cemetery. And I'll be taking some pictures because of the progress we did. I just hit myself in the face. What you see is what you get. So, please don't be disrespectful on this video. Please hit like if you want to subscribe. Hit subscribe if you want to comment. Comment. Well, we found a headstone. We pulled it up. We probably walked over poor headstone so many times. Here are the yuccas we cut down. And here are some more of the yuccas we cut down. So yeah. And here's what our mystery volunteer did. So now we can walk underneath here and see the headstones underneath here and here, my great grandparents. And we finally can see this one over here. So I am very proud of us 
and the progress the cemetery has taken the last two years. April will be three years. I cannot believe how remarkable it looks in here. And here's Isaac Laconi. I made a promise to Isaac and everybody in here that I will come out and clean even if I didn't have help or if I had help. One thing, if people tell you, tell you you can't do nothing, get up and show them and prove them wrong because that's what I did. I got up and I'm out here cleaning and I have help and I didn't give up and I kept fighting and I will keep going till I can't go no more. And I have my boyfriend William to thank or thanks on that. So, yep, that's our progress. So this is the end of the video and I hope you guys enjoy. All right, love you all, bye for now. With the cemetery, and like I promised Isaac that I'd be out here cleaning the cemetery, taking care of it, and I made a group page. So I can't believe it's been two years already taking care of this lovely cemetery and making it great again. Sorry guys. Let's get back to business here, guys. I kind of leave those sticks there. That would have drive me nuts. Alright, now we're going to my other fourth great grandparents, which we're pretty close to when I grab the sticks out of the way.
how it looks in here and I'm gonna let you guys go. Bye for now. Hello to my YouTube channel. Well, I want to take you on the journey of the cemetery of how I got started of cleaning and how it led up to this. When we first walked up here, the cemetery was filled with yuccas on some of these headstones and I will put them in the video. So let me take you on my journey with the cemetery. Sorry, I had to move the stick. Alright, for this section here, I started trying to find my great grandparents. So I started over here when we were looking at the letters on the ground. So we didn't see them over in this section. So we started on this section and we started looking at where the letters were, like for example, of this one here, there's this letter stone right there. So we're going through each section, row by row. Sergeant and rifle team, salute our comrades. channel this is the progress I have got done over here as you can tell the yuccas and somebody with the lawnmower not in the cemetery but somewhere else there and William is working all the way down there we got some leaf piles down that way for the two of us we're doing a great job I got some photos so I will be adding them in there as well and the grass needs to be mowed because it's quite tall as you can tell it's quite tall if I got myself in the view so yeah it's like let me move my lens 
the grass is right up here. And this product will continue working throughout the weeks to come, and the days to come, and the months to come. solution on my great grandmother Rosalina and her son is buried next to her my uncle Paul Mayer he also served in the Civil War as well they came from Germany I believe he was born in Pennsylvania. Then, these over here, when I get closer, this is uh, when you see bars around the cemetery like this. This is a family plot, so all of them are related. This is a family plot burial. And these two headstones over here are, I don't know who they are, they just have initials on them. But over here, whoops, they, they are, I'm sorry to my YouTube, I am just very angry, upset, aggravated. And you'll see the next clip that's coming in why I couldn't really walk into the cemetery there's just high grass and I'm not too happy that's why I had to end the video all right I am not happy that's all I can say
see this headstone with the tree. And if we walk over here, now we can see this headstone easier. And we can see my grandparents earlier, or earlier now. Hello to my YouTube channel, Melanie Riverside Cemetery Beauty. Today we are putting out the flowers. There's a Christmas wreath and some bag. I want to say thank you to the people that have donated in the last two years. I didn't need any flowers this year. We're going to try to get as many headstones as we can with this bag. We walked all the way up here, so I ask please be respectful to the video. And I will throw a clip in and pictures of the flowers that we put down from last year and this year. So, Merry Christmas to everybody and Merry Christmas to everybody in Riverside. And thank you for all your help and support, even if you donated, came out and cleaned flowers. A lot of things go a long way and just here to make it lovely and for the families that cannot make it out to the cemetery or they don't know they have family members in here this is why I do it so for everybody that's in here I have family in here as well so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and Merry Christmas. See you guys in the future after this clip.